Haley got this Hatchimal that she was begging for for the longest time. I never really seen a Hatchimal in person. I did a YouTube video just to see exactly what a Hatchimal was. And basically, it's just this little furry thing inside of this egg that's going to actually crack out of the egg like a real chicken. You probably need a grown up, a oh, grown, a grown up to uh, help you open it. All right. So this is how it looks inside the egg. He's hatching. He's ready to hatch. There he is. Look. Look, he's breaking through the egg. No, don't pull it. You got to keep rubbing him. Keep rubbing him. Are you excited, Haley? Yes. Definitely. There he is, Ma. Finally, guys. Uh-oh. His beak. It came through. I want to name him Aiden. Aiden, if it's a boy, what about if it's a girl? Lola. Oh, those are beautiful names. Look! Oh my goodness! There he is. He's coming through. Okay, look. He's almost done. Let's pull. Oh, he's going to take it off. Whoa! Look at that! Oh, baby. Oh, shoot. I have a dragon. She is so adorable, Haley. Right now, we are on our way to go do some dumpster diving. Oh, this car, boy, I tell you, it's giving me the flux. Now, I just put some power steering fluid in here. And the thing still don't want to move correctly. I got really bad power steering problems with this car. And it's going to cost me about $800 to get fixed. And I refuse to get it fixed because this car is not even worth it. I'm on my way to Home Depot first because I gotta get another hazmat suit and I gotta get a mask, face mask because the one that I had was pretty old. So I'm gonna go get that and then we're gonna go off to work. Ah, come on car. Oh, I'm sweating bullets trying to get out of here. Come on car. Ah. It took 20 minutes to get out of a parking spot. Hopefully I can find something great. That's the goal. Today is a really good day, I think, to go because of the time of the month. Because it's the first of the month. And catch your checks and come on. It's the first of the month. And everybody get up. Like a grown man on me. <laughs> Got the nerdy be in the driver's seat of the cop. Hey, doggy. <coughs> hey, doggy. <coughs> What do we have here? It looks as if somebody moved. What are these? Some tools. Cool. I can see if my brother wants these. He told me to let him know whether or not I find tools. And if I do, to let him know. So I'm going to take a picture of these really quick. 
to see if he want me to get them. And if so, I'm gonna get them and then just give them to him later. I'm coming up on this gate here and inside you see this beautiful, beautiful couch set with the otter in over there. It looks as if somebody moved out. I want to get back here so bad, but I don't know who the new maintenance man is. I used to have the maintenance man number to be able to get back here, and unfortunately I can't. Just like that grill over there, I don't know if you can see it right there, but that's in pretty good shape as well. What do we have? What do we have? I see a Zenith flat screen. I see a Keurig. I'm gonna take it because I think it's gonna work. And we have some period pots down here. I think I'm gonna get that period though, guys. What do you have up here? Some nice, cool looking gap book bag. Another bag. Little car seat. Don't want this stuff. Yeah. A bunch of stuff that I'll leave up here for another diver that can probably use it. What's this? It's a nice basket. I don't want that either. Okay. I got them headed off. And here we have an oyster. Oh, that's disgusting. Yeah. An oyster toaster oven. But it's so disgusting. Uh-uh. No way. I'm going to leave that in here. Or well, actually, I'll put it up here for somebody to see it. And they can take it. But that is disgusting. person never really cleaned up they dug on cooking equipment like really George Fountain grill don't want that somebody can use that so I did a completely listen on it and it says something like this is worth about 40 bucks now I can't take it home clean it out good you know because this can be cleaned off I can do that but I don't know if I feel like dealing with it I don't know is it really worth it take it all the way home then mess around they have roaches in it and then it get in my house it's not that serious for 40 bucks i'll just leave that there for somebody else to take as well as those door forming grills bye bye baker so we have over here some nike air max 2016 they're a little dirty but the grip is still in great condition i'm gonna do a completed listing on these but any type of Air Max, and I ain't gonna say any type, but some Air Maxes, they run some pretty good money. And I think because these are 2016, as you can see here, they are probably gonna be worth some money. So I'm gonna go ahead and take these dirty and all. The customer probably have a way of cleaning them. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these. Let's see what we have over here. Somebody definitely moved. Here comes a truck. So let me move my van out of the way so they can get by. These are so freaking disgusting. Like, I probably can take them home and clean them, but I don't know if I want to be bothered with that. That's, I don't know. I think I'm going to leave these here. I just, just like with the Keurig, I'm going to keep here as well. The one that I found earlier, I'm just going to take the parts off and sell the parts. But I think I'm going to leave this here for somebody else to take, like one of my homeless friends. They probably can use this, you know. There's no point in me taking it. I just found this Apple little uh, adapter here that I am going to take because, as you guys know, a lot of Apple products do sell. And just so you can see, that's by Apple right there. So I think I'm going to go ahead and take that. Here we have nothing. Uh, nothing. Nothing that's worth getting. So I'm going to go ahead and move around because I don't see anything else. But this I am going to take. 